Welcome back people, we got some more Fishing Planet for you guys here again today doing more fish monster missions. This is to get the Rocky Turtle Spoon. So to catch this we need, um, we, well to get this spoon we need to catch three turtles. We've done lots of fish monster missions all across the channel, you can check those out for anyone who's interested. So we want to get this spoon so that way we can then catch the actual monster itself, the trout monster. T-Rex, trout monster, T-Rex, wow, nice. <laughs> I'm expecting it to look really cool and really big and yeah. Anytime we do live streams, I always use face cam and mic and anytime I make videos like this, I just randomly hit record. They always turn out to be the best videos I've ever made. So catch three turtles here in Rocky Lake. So I'm going to spawn in here where you see my guys lit up in orange. I'm showing you my setup. You don't have to use the same as me, but um, as long as you've got a spinning setup, I guess it will make it that a little bit quicker to try and catch these turtles. Again, you don't have to use the same spoon as me. As long as you're fishing the same location, casting the same distance, you will be able to get these turtles, not a problem. So, casting in between, probably there is where, in fact, there where I'm casting right now, straight in front, which is 98 feet. That's where I've caught all the turtles. I did try real speed free for a little bit because that's what I caught some tree branch um, on before. But it seems like that real speed one seemed to work the best. I did obviously have to make a few edits into this video just to speed up the process of showing you me catching these turtles. But the reason why I thought this location is because there's a few rocks here and I thought hiding around the rocks, not only there's going to be a few fish, but there's going to be a few of those turtles. I did actually catch some shells as well. Anytime there is updates on this game, I will let you guys know about the update, the updates, what's coming in the update, and obviously we'll be buying the new DLC, setting up a live stream, and showing you that new update as quick as I possibly can. Making it speed is pretty fast, so it doesn't take me long to download. We'll set up a live stream, we'll be showing you new lakes, new rods, new reels, new tackle, anything that Fish and Planet has to offer. Buying that DLC, getting into that lake, completing those new missions, making separate videos of those, and also showing you how and where to catch those certain new unique fish as well. So... If you're interested in Fishing Planet, that's a good reason to subscribe. When you hit that notification bell, make sure it says all, so you don't miss out on updates on this game. This game is great. I've played it for nearly five years now. I've played other fishing games as well, and obviously every now and again, I show new games that come out, as well as unboxing videos, moto blogs, and much more. So, if you're interested in Fishing Planet or anything else, I guess... If you do need any other missions, any if you're struggling on any other fish monster missions, you can look across the channel. I'm pretty sure it'd be there. If it isn't there, it will be there very, very soon. But we've completed all the missions of every lake and obviously showing how and where to catch certain fish in different lakes. So if you are struggling on this game in any sort of way, look across the channel. I'm pretty sure it will be there. If you've got any comments, you can always leave that in the comment section below as well. And I try and get back to you guys. As quick as I possibly can. So to start off with, I was using this medium spoon. Again, you don't have to use the same spoon. As long as you're fishing in the same location as me, you'll be pretty much good. But I was using this and I did catch a couple of fish using this medium spoon. So I cranked it up and ended up using the same medium spoon, but as a hash six. Just so that way I didn't keep on catching fish. Because I didn't want to keep on catching fish as weird as it is. Even though that's what I'm normally after. <laughs> This time I'm actually going for turtles, a bit of a strange one. Yeah, shells, um, in total doing this mission, I probably pulled in, I'd say at least, no more than 10 shells. But yeah, I did I did bring in a few shells here and there, and obviously I did bring in a couple of fish. But it seems like real speed one, and just keep doing stop and go, that's what ended up working for me. And yeah, casting straight in front of me there, that also worked as well, so... I think it's this one is where I end up catching an actual fish. Yeah, because the, yeah, the line goes a little bit cranky. <laughs> there we go. Okay, yeah, I thought I'd just show that anyway. So because I caught a fish, I did actually end up catching a fish on this spoon as well. It was only the one, but I decided to change to a bigger hook just in case. I, it might not work like this, but bigger hook, you might eventually, hopefully, possibly <laughs> hook up things that little bit easier like turtles shells and that kind of thing i could be wrong but that's just kind of my my thought if i have a bigger hook i might have that chance to try and hook up that little bit quicker whether that's true or not i don't know but 
Yeah, as long as you're using a spinning rod, it doesn't have to be the same as mine, but as long as you're using a spinning rod and obviously some kind of lure, then you will eventually catch these turtles. To catch them didn't take me too long once I found the spot. Once I caught this first one, I kept them doing the same as where I showed you, just casting straight in front in between those two rocks there. And that seemed to work for me to get all of these free turtles. That's what worked. And... As I mentioned, it didn't take that long to actually catch them. I thought it was going to be a little bit of a struggle because I did keep on bringing in quite a few shells. Um, and then obviously I was getting the odd fish here and there as well. So yeah, I thought it was going to take me long. But this one, real time, I wouldn't say I spent more than about 30 to 40 minutes at the most doing it i wouldn't say any longer than that the longest part was obviously for me to try and find the spot because i was casting all around here and i ended up finding it in between those two rocks where i just showed you so that's where i continuously kept doing it and then that's where i ended up getting the last two it's all right to do it quick if you know where if you don't know where then obviously that's what makes it longer that's why i make these videos so that way for you guys it doesn't take you as long as what it does me it probably took me more time editing this video than anything else, to be honest. But there's our second turtle that we needed. And we released them. It does also say by us doing what we're doing, it doesn't harm the turtle or anything like that. In any sort of way, just to mention, we are family friendly as well. You'll never hear any bad language from me. If I ever do play a game, a new game that comes out and it does have any bad language or anything like that. Or, yeah, I'll always mention that before I start the video or the live stream. I'll always mention if there's going to be bad language in the game and stuff like that. Just to give give you guys a head up, heads up and let you know that it's, you need to have a yeah PG or, or whatever. But anyway, I don't really play too many br brutal games if I'm honest. Okay, so is this a shell or is this the turtle? I think it is the turtle. Hold on. Yeah, okay, so it's the turtle. There we have it. So keep an eye out for the next video coming after this. We will be catching that T-Rex monster. It will be coming straight after this video. So yeah, keep an eye out for it. I hope you guys are enjoying these videos. I'm doing them because you guys are requesting me to do them. I don't really need to do them to be honest, but it does give you some XP and cash and stuff like that once you catch, once you get this and then obviously going for the fish monster. It will give you some cash XP and some bait coins. Hope you guys did enjoy this one. Subscribe so you don't miss out on new updates on Fish and Planet. Don't forget to drop a like. Also lets us know you're still enjoying Fish and Planet. We catch you people again soon for some more fun and games. I'm out. Fish Monster Mission is next. T-Rex.